write this number in standard form. Now, formula for standard form is a times 10 raised to the power n. This a now, a represents numbers from 1 to 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Numbers within this represents a. So this means that from this formula, this a, if I'm to move from, shift from this decimal point, I will shift to 1. I cannot stop in 0. 0 is not a whole number. I have to stop in a number between 1 to 9. I must stop in a whole number, number between 1 to 9. So I cannot stop here. So I will move here. 2, 3, 4. So once I get to 4, I can stop in 4 because 4 is a whole number. It's from numbers between 1 to 9. So if I reach, once I reach out, add my decimal point and stop, it becomes 4.831. From the formula, times 10, times 10, this 10 here. Raised to power n, this n represents number of times I moved from my decimal point. So I moved how many times? 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. So raised to power minus 4. I moved 4 times from my decimal. And um, remember, my, uh, mm, 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 this has to be in minus form because I'm moving from the left to the right. If I'm moving from the right to the left, my answer will be in positive form. But since I'm moving from the left, it will be in the negative form. Bye.